my wife, Lordina, and myself, and the entire NDC party. We visited our elder brother, our uncle, elder statesman of the nation, to pay our condolences for the passing of our mother. We heard it in the wind, but as our tradition indicates, you don't assume that it's true until it has been confirmed. Unfortunately, our worst fears have been confirmed. And so, on behalf of all of us, we want to extend our condolences to the family and say how we are saddened by this event. She was a very respected person, very dignified woman, and uh, when she was First Lady, we all called her Mother of the Nation. And so, if God has called the Mother of the Nation, fortunately we still have our Father. And so we came to just come and let the family know that in this time of grief and distress, it is not you alone who are feeling the pain. It is the whole nation. All of us are united in expressing our condolences to the family. When you've lived well in society, and uh, your turn comes. Society gathers ar around to sort of bid you a farewell. And uh, I, I, I'm so touched, so on it, that uh, in spite of our different political outlooks, uh, her pattern has brought us together. So thank you for coming in your numbers to mourn. And uh, when the family has set the timetable, uh, we'll take it as our duty to inform the president and the entire team. So we do the right thing for her. So thank you, Mr. President. Thank you to all of you.